everybody, it's me, Debs. Today's video is going to be on this poof. Oh yes, the oh so mighty popular um, side poof that I always rock. I have decided to do a video on it because I get so many people that ask me about how I get my hair like this. So if you're interested in seeing how I get this little side poof, stay tuned for the video. Please excuse the ratchetness that is going on with my face and my hair and all that. I just got out the shower, so I'm getting ready to go run some errands. I gotta get these brows done. I gotta get these nails and a pedicure. I need to go buy some more hair products. I just got like a list of stuff that I need to do. But before I headed out the door, I wanted to make sure that I did this video for you guys. It's really simple, but um, I just wanted to make a video about it so I can show you guys. So first of all, I just um, co-washed my hair. As you can see here, it's still um, a little bit wet, but I did um, um, squeeze some of the water out and kind of take a um, microfiber towel and just kind of squeeze my hair a little bit so it wouldn't be dripping for the video. But you see, um, my hair is a little bit defined and I still have those stringy pieces from um, from my leave out when I wear my wigs okay so all I do is my hair is still a little bit wet I put in um, my kinky curly knot today which is almost out this is some of the stuff I got to pick up today the kinky curly knot today I've already applied to my hair to co-wash my hair I used um, the VO5 cheapy conditioner it's like 79 to 99 cents depending on where you buy it but I just use that moisturizing uh, VO5 conditioner and I just co-wash my hair in the shower that's all and I put the leave-in conditioner that's it that's all I've done um, so now I just go ahead and I put it in the side pony and I use um, the top of knee highs these are the ones that I have here um, I wanted to show you I usually don't get this kind but um, CVS was the closest um, uh, drugstore near me I couldn't find a Walgreens but Walgreens has the really good ones they're the ones that come in that little bubble plastic ball kind of looks like an Easter egg and they're like I don't know 20 ooh, excuse me they're like 29 cents so all I do right oops all I do is take this elastic part you see this the elastic part right here I just cut that part off cut that off that's it I don't need this anymore so that goes trash so all I need is this part here the top and I just stretch it as much as I can right and it becomes a hair tie I use this because it's less damaging on my hair it doesn't pull any hair out there's no little um, little metal parts or anything on it that's gonna pull my hair out um, sometimes I put a little oil on it and, and rub it like that so it doesn't leave the little creases or doesn't put so much um, pressure on my hair where it starts breakage so yeah this one here is stretched out really good so this would be the one that I'll be putting on okay so I know I want all of it to go to the side I'm just gonna take this and I'm just gonna push it up I don't know if you can see that and I know I want more volume coming down so I will make it a little bit shorter here just by pushing it up um, I think I'm gonna use two because this one feels a little bit loose I dropped the other one hold on ah. well you know what I'll just use this I'll just use this one because I want it to be a little bit tighter I hope you guys can see me really good in this camera. What is this? In my hair? Oh, tuh. Okay. So there, I have it in there. My hair covers the, the, um, the stocking thingy, so I'm not worried about it showing. Okay. 
Now I may pull this down a little bit so that I can get a little bit of hair out so it'll look a little bit longer. Now the only thing left for me to do is just kind of take the curls and like twirl them around my fingers, finger coil. The frizzy parts, like I guess here, here, over here. So I don't have that much kinky curly, but this is usually all I use. This or um, the Upper Management, you've seen this before in some of my other videos by um, Kiss My Face. Upper Management, it's a really, really good gel, a light gel. It doesn't leave my hair crunchy or anything. I get it from Whole Foods and I get Kinky Curly from Target, which I am heading to when I get off. I mean, when I get out of, out of uh, the house, when I hit the street. You know what I mean, Jesus. <laughs> I just use about that much, just dip my finger in it, and then I start going to town. So I'll take a little piece here, put it on there, and just roll my fingers around it. Roll, roll, until I get a little bit of a curl, a defined curl. You see? Take this piece, put some on there. Be careful not to put too much because you'll get that product buildup and when it dries, it'll be like white and crusty and it'll look really disgusting. But this is all I do. And you see it just curls on up. See that? Just curls on up and that's it. So I'm not gonna do my whole head because I don't really feel like it, but usually on days when I want it to look like perfection, I will go through my whole head and do this. Like kind of like spaced like between my fro and just kind of pick little pieces and just randomly twirl. Twirl and booyah. That's all I do. That is all I, I don't, you know, I really don't understand why people don't believe me when they ask me, how you get your hair like that? How you do your hair like that? I love your hair. What did you do? What did you do to it? How do you get it to, to do that? I will say I wash my hair with conditioner and I just take my fingers and just kind of twirl it and it just act, curls by itself. It just, it's just my texture. But people will look at me and be like, right, sure, it just curls by itself. Like, I'm lying. Why I gotta lie? Are you kidding me? And from now on, I'm going to tell those people, hey, go check my video out on YouTube. And you'll see me doing my hair. I don't have a kit. I don't have any of that stuff. I'm just simply doing this. And that's it. That is how I get my hair to curl. Now, you see these little stubber pieces here? These won't curl good when I, you know, that's what they'll look like. They'll be these long, loose strands. And that is just not going to be jiggy with the rest of my hair. I can't get jiggy with this. This is not cute. <laughs> so that's where the straw comes in. Bam. You can take whatever straw you want. Um, I will tell you, if you use like straws from like McDonald's, they're really bigger. So you'll get a bigger, looser curl. But once I roll my hair around the straw, I just let it dry. By the time I leave the house, it's, it's dry. Sometimes I have to leave it in my hair until I get to work and then I pull it out before I get out the car. But I just take the, the straw and I'll cut to about how much I think I need. I guess about there, about that much. And I'll just take my hair and I will just roll my hair on the straw. like that. And stick it in there with a bobby pin. Oh crap, just dropped it. Okay. It's kind of hard to do this video while I'm doing this. I'm usually a lot quicker, but I'm trying to look in this camera. Okay. 
and just leave it in there like that and it will dry and when it dries then I just separate and kind of just you know blend it in with everything else it looks fine and it holds so yeah that's all I do ladies there's another frizzy right there see rub it down the shaft of the hair and twirl and twirl and twirl and twirl boo yeah that's it simple yeah it is all I do to my hair to get it to look good to get it to look curly I simply do this this is all Usually by second or third day hair, it's, it's a, it gets bigger, which I love. I love it when it's bigger. I like it when it's wet too because um, the curls just look like they're more defined. I will tell you that once you finish twirling and doing this process, you don't want to touch your hair. Do not put your fingers in your hair. Let it air dry just as is. Do not touch it. So you want to do this as soon as you get out of the shower. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and finish my hair and then I'll put some pictures up on the end. I really hope that this kind of, you know, made it easier for you guys who've been asking about it. I know you guys requested it like a long time ago and I keep forgetting to do a video on it. So I really, really hope this has helped. Um, yeah, but this is, that's all I do. So I'm going to, you know, tweak it a little bit and probably push this more to the front and just kind of make it look cuter. I like it when my curls are like in my face like this kind of like down so I'll probably fix that a little bit so that it's looser just by pulling the band down a little bit but that's all I'm about to go and uh, get myself beauty five for the weekend thank you guys so much for watching hello to all my new subscribers thank you guys for watching my videos for your awesome comments I really really appreciate it and if you're not following me on Instagram follow me Debs does celeb. That's D E B Z Z, not an S. D E B Z D A C E L E. Thank you guys so much. Peace.